All right. Three, two, one, go! Whee! Right on. All right. These two runners are off. We're using Haxer's audio on the right side, Rupert on the left side. Both runners looks like they're gonna do the pipe rub and bam, get that mushroom right out of that question block. Easy peasy. They're gonna go for the sky. Are they gonna do the one up? Same thing that Zikopee does? They are not, not. Zikopee has his own little way of doing that little uh, mushroom. He's the only one who's uh, been doing that so far, so. Uh, very interesting. Haxer's audio is a little low. I don't know why his audio is always so low. Let's take a look at Rupert's here. Yeah, Rupert's is a little bit louder. Rupert's is wavy though. Why are both of these runners audios garbage? All right, anyways. Oh, Rupert having a little slip up in one, two, but if there's anything we've learned from this tournament, guys. Oh! Damn, that would have been sick. If there's anything we've learned from this tournament, small mess ups do not mean that much. Really, they don't, right, guys? They're like, we have seen people minutes apart and they both have the same amount of points. It's, it's, it's actually incredible. All right, Rupert just behind a little bit. All right, so the points that you can generate in World 1 are you have to frame perfect jump in the Hammer Brother battle first, and you have to stay ducking on the airship. Now, we know from experience Haxer hasn't been one to do the duck strat uh, in his races. I think maybe he tried in race 2 in his last race. I can't remember. Um... But he has not shown that uh, he's been wanting to do that. But I think he has actually been practicing. He has realized now that that two-point swing is definitely worth not, uh, you know, going behind on. So I think we're going to see him do it this time. And uh, Rupert trying to catch his way back up. Not making any mistakes here. Looking good. Head didn't get stuck in the ceiling. And he's good to go. Very nice. Axe having to fight the bro first. He does not get the frame jump. All right. This gives Rupert a very good chance. A very good chance to get a one point lead on him, especially if they both nail the duck clip. Rupert can try and get a full clear world one here. Does he do it? Ah, oh, and he doesn't get it. All right, so they are still pretty much even. It's definitely gonna come down to this airship now. Both runners get the same RNG more or less in world one. Same kind of fight the hammer brother in the same spot kind of thing. All right, and here they go. Rupert goes for the, the bottom spot, but he gets it, he's good. All right, so this is going to be interesting for both of our runners because it is very difficult to grab the fire flower with doing the duck strap. We have seen runners do it. It's not, it's not impossible. It just creates a little bit more stress. Rupert going for the mushroom house first. Maybe he gets that fire flower. We don't know. Does he get it? He does not get it. Very unfortunate. The mushroom house first has not been a strat that many runners have been using uh, too much yet because that that. That item isn't really gonna muck up your inventory too much. You still have to go for that extra music box. Or sorry, that extra mushroom house in World 2. Axer working on his duck strats. Grabs the fire flower. He has not peaked yet. Still has not peaked yet. Is his controller gonna screw him over though? Dance my puppets. We don't know if Rupert's- Oh, and Haxer stood up there. Not going to be able to get the point. Oh, and Rupert takes damage. Also, not going to be able to get the point. Neither runner gets the ducking point. Axer must be thinking, must be thinking right now that Rupert's got that point, but he doesn't. Neither runner has that point. Wow, okay, okay. This is getting intense then. No two point swings from either. That was a great opportunity for uh, Rupert to come and clutch. Taking that damage there, but Rupert does not have the fire flowers, so. All right, here we go. Working, working our way into world two. Now, every runner is guaranteed a movement of two after they beat the first level. So in world two, they want to kill the sun and they want to try and get all movements of two. And they also want to do a mushroom house after they get the hammer. That has nothing to do with the points, but that seems like the meta that a lot of these runners have been doing uh, to make sure that their inventory doesn't stay all clogged up. Haxer, two fire flowers, probably shaking his head like, what a surprise. And he gets a very bad Hammer Brother movement. Uh, if the Hammer Brother moves left, then he's more likely to get a movement of one after this. So we'll see how it goes. All right, Rupert coming up. Rupert's turn for the 2-1. Rupert is a very experienced Mario 3 runner, but he's also a very experienced Mario runner in general. 
Rupert knows Mario 1, Lost Levels, Mario 2, Super Mario World, Super Mario Brothers 3. I don't know if Rupert knows much about Mario 64, but he knows a lot of Marios, and he's been playing Mario 35 lately. So, uh, he's in that, that, he's competed, man, he's in it. Haxer gets early P-Speed, while well, Rupert gets very fast slide strat there, very nice on Rupert's side. He's, Rupert's not gonna have Fire Flower though for the Boom Boom, so he is gonna he's gonna bleed out another three seconds there against Haxor, especially if Rupert doesn't get early P speed. I think Haxor got a movement of one there, so I don't think he's gonna be able to get the movement of two. Rupert got the exact same movement of Haxor, so we'll see. Rupert with a movement of one as well, and oh, and he touches the stairs. Oh, he's gonna go back though. Nice. That still could be better than nothing, right? No, I think Hacks are still getting movements to two right now. I think Hacks are still on the movement of two train. Very nice on Haxer's side. Alright, alright. Movement of one. So Haxer is out of the movement of two game. So they both are. So the only thing left is the sun. Alright, Hacks are doing nice work of two three here. Gonna go for the duck strat. Boom, the shell shell hit. So Rupert is not going to be able to get his fire flower back until. Nice, and he avoids the music box. Rupert is going for the I don't want to deal with music box strat. And so that's gonna catch him up a lot, especially if he doesn't need it later in the run. There's no guarantee that you actually need the music box in these runs. So it's uh, very interesting to see. Just getting pixeled all over the place on Rupert's side, but he's still doing pretty good, so. Oh, and he's right in there. Nice. Hacks are gonna go for the sun kill. Looks like he's gonna do the, the straight shot throw, and he does get the sun. Both runners get Fire Flower, though, as well as their first card. So there we go. First... Wait, whoops. First... First tick that we can give. The Hammer Brother's gonna tell Haxer, you have to go down to 2-5, because that's where I am, so he doesn't have a choice. I wonder if Rupert is gonna go for the sun. He's gonna go for the sun, but he's gonna wait right here. And he does get the sun, very nice. Both runners getting the sun out of the way. Rupert gets the star, Haxer gets flower star, mushroom. And just like that, he gets a point. Now he's gonna have to fight the hammer brother. Is he gonna go back up to the mushroom house though? That is the question. Rupert in a very, very annoying situation here, forced to do 2-4, uh, which is very difficult. It's a very stressful level. He does pretty good on it though. Just like that, he's gonna be out of there. Hacks are gonna do the mushroom house. He gets the fire flower as well. Good RNG. We we don't have to listen to him complain about how bad his RNG was this run. And I am definitely relieved of that. Alright, so he's do doing pretty good. He's doing pretty good. I like to see it. Alright, Rupert is gonna do the hammer now. Probably gonna go back to the mushroom house as well. It definitely is the strategy. It definitely is the strategy. Rupert! Did Rupert get Flower Star Mushroom as well? No, Rupert got Flower Star Flower. He's gonna have to go back to the Mushroom House here. And what does he get? What does he get? If he gets a flower, this would be really good for him. Ah, oh, and he does not get the flower. So Rupert is not being greeted with the same kind of RNG as Haxer. But this kind of RNG is something that can go on throughout the rest of the run. Now, don't let it- don't let it trick you, though. Just because you have the flower from the Mushroom House doesn't mean you're not gonna have to do Mushroom Houses later in the run. Mushroom Houses are great for that protecting your inventory, right? Your items in your inventory, so it'd be great. So, unfortunately, Rupert is not getting as lucky. Ooh, takes damage there, but he does have a leaf, so he should be able to get his Fire Flower back. But the problem is, is he needs that leaf in his inventory. He does have the mushroom though from World 1, and he got the flower, so he's actually... We need to see him equip that mushroom. We need to see him equip that mushroom. It is safe to equip that mushroom. Doesn't equip that mushroom. That's risky business. He, the, the mushroom... I don't think the mushroom is really helping his inventory, but that leaf is. He needed to not use that leaf, that's for sure. Alright, not looking too bu bad. Both runners on the same airship, and you definitely like to see that in a run. Hax has got the two-point lead right here, but those are uh, card point and RNG point. Totally able uh, anyone's game to get those points, so you can't really count yourself uh, in the lead with that. Ooh, gonna go for the fire kill, gets the six shots, eight, ten. 
Goes for the off-screen wand grab, doesn't nail it, but he definitely tried it, man. Ooh, Rupert. Alright, uh, Rupert's standing on the crates. We always ask ourselves, what is in those crates, man? What is what is being shipped? Some people say it's Goombas. You know? I don't know. What do you guys think? What do you guys think is being shipped in that airship? It's definitely going to, like, is this airship going to World 1? Is that where it's flying to? Or is it flying to, no, it's flying to World 3. So the ship is going to World 3. Yeah, it's, it's, why would I think it's going backwards? It's going to World 3. That's where it takes you. So, bathing suits, maybe? Stuff for the beach? Suntan lotion, bathing suits, towels. Like, is that what's being shipped to World 3? I don't know. Very interesting. Very interesting. Alright, hacks are making great work of 3-1. But anything goes in this. Anything goes. Runaway bro versus not runaway bro can very can be very damaging. And Rupert does have the flowers, so Rupert's gonna have to clutch this. Hacks are getting a very unfortunate Hammer Brother movement. He is right there, ready to do runaway. And it I, it distracts runners. I don't know if it directly distracted him from getting early P-Speed, but I know it definitely does it to me. Um, here and there. Because it's just stressful to see the Hammer Brother there. It feels unsafe. Right? It feels unsafe. Is Rupert gonna get the Fire Flower here, though? Yes, he is. Very nice Fire Flower. Right on. He's gonna keep his P-Speed, and he's gonna be out of there. I think that Fire Flower backup grab is faster. Is faster than the Fire Flower grab in 3-2. Not sure. I've, I haven't timed either of them. Alright, Rupert gets the star. Meanwhile, Haxer is annihilating 3-3. Double check his coin count. Will he hit 44? He, he did hit 44, but he has enough. He does not have... He, he's got a zeros digit, right? So he's only gonna go up by 5 or stay at 0. Rupert having a little splish splash in the bath here. Ooh, goes in! The fish! Alright, he's good, he's good. Haxer, another scare with Runaway, bro. But that doesn't matter because he's got to worry about door three right now. Does he get door three? Oh, and he does not get door three. Oh, and Rupert, the flower star flower king, man. It's like he's forgotten how to get mushrooms. You just full speed and do a quick turn back and you're good. That is it for that mushroom. But Rupert is in a very nice spot here um, with Hammer Brothers, right? Rupert doesn't really have to worry about um, Runaway Bro, which is very nice. At least I don't think so. This game works in very... Oh, Rupert makes it. He gets 45 coins right on. And Haxer is safe out of Runaway Bro. Um, I think Haxer ended up actually get getting uh, the situation where he gets no water battles and the special tile. But we're going to see. Rupert with another flower as well and a movement of one. We saw Rupert practicing door three. Is he going to nail it though? The door three. He, he knows how to do it. He was nailing it. Oh, and he doesn't get it. Very unfortunate. Hax is going to go back. Get the special tile. Got to activate it. There you go. Special tile right there. You can activate that special tile in either worlds 3, 5, or 6. Ooh, he got the double special tile. He's going to have to wrap back down. No water battles either. All right. Rupert in a tough spot here. Might have to fight a water bro. No, he's good. Nice, and Rupert needs the- yes, there you go, yes, that is the move, Rupert. Very nice. So Rupert is not going to lose that two-point swing here for the- oh! Yeah, yeah, there we go, Rupert with the butt slide strats with the P-Speed rebuild. Yeah, nobody wants to go in that water. Keeps his P-Speed as well, that was sick. That was sick. I don't like that run across, that is way too scary. Nice, and he gets the star. All right, Rupert. Just run straight to the card and just do a tur quick turn back. Give you a mushroom. Now he's got to go down. Oh, he's gonna. He doesn't want runaway. I. Uh, it makes sense. It makes sense. He I hope he knows his special tiles. Haxer nailing the H jump as well. Very very nice, man. That H jump is super important. All right, Rupert's in the clear. As well as Haxer, Rupert gets... N oh, whoops, I did the wrong tiles. Uh, but that is that, and then there we go. Right? Oh, wait, no, I, I did them right. I did the right, I'm sorry. Yeah, there we go. Okay, we're in the clear. We're in the clear. We got it. Yeah, Rupert, you're good for your... Nice, there you go. 
All right, nice guys. Looking pretty good, looking pretty good. So Rupert just needs to get some RNG here. He's got to get a mushroom here for his card. Uh, he's got to do a mushroom house, get a fire flower, then he'll have two points. And he's got to get special tile. Not bad, quick turn back. Too big, but he got it. Hey, he got it, man. Love to see it. That was a big turn back though. Wait, did I? No, we're good. Very nice, man. Rupert knows. He's out of it. He, he is pro- I bet Rupert is so relieved right now that he doesn't have to deal with those stupid cards anymore. Very nice, though. Oh, and Rupert also gets the age jump, man. These guys are age kings. Very nice, man. This is a fantastic race one so far. Uh, Rupert behind by two RNG points. That is it. That is all he's behind by. Two R Look, and now he just knows how to do mushrooms all the time. <laughs> you gotta love it, guys. You love to see it. All of a sudden, he just turns into the Mushroom King. He just knows what to do. Very nice. One on the airship, one off the airship. We have seen this before. Yesterday, Human Mustard was in the exact same position as uh, Rupert is versus Haxer uh, against Maiba. And y Human Mustard was so close, man, to so many points. He was doing so well. So, like we said, this, this is very far, very far from over. I think... I think Rupert did did the right thing by avoiding Runaway Bro. That would be too much time. It was a risk that he was not willing to take, and I think it was a good risk. Yeah. Yo, must Human Mustard did great yesterday, though. He, like it was cra it was crazy. I bet I hope he watched back the race and realized like there were so many th so many chances. Right? It's crazy. Uh, it's crazy how the points work, man. And we want to see everyone back for season three. All right, Haxer. Patented, I'm better than MFP at 4-1 strats. Nails him. Doesn't nail it. Yes! I don't want to say I'm happy. He knows I'm talking about it right now. He knows I'm talking about it. That was, um... I, I would I would love to brag about that, but that's just a, an accident. Like, um, kind of like a frame rule mistake. Uh, not really much he could do about that, so... It's still technically I'm better than MFP strat though, so we gotta give him that. Can't take that from him. Rupert with the stop kills. Maybe not comfortable with the fire kills. Haxer gotta go for the double block grab. Misses the second block. Maybe he didn't try for him. Not not too sure, but regardless, he got through and he's, he's doing pretty good. Doing pretty good. Not having fire flower here shouldn't be uh, too much of an issue. His, his hammer brother battles might be slower by like four, four or five frames or something, but other than that, uh, I don't think so. He does. This isn't 100%, so he can't use a music box here. So he does have his hammer. Um, so this situation. Ooh, he clipped. Is he gonna get it back though? He does get it back. First world where you can get a punishment. If Haxer makes a mistake here, if anything, he can take damage. If he takes damage, he doesn't lose the point. Looking pretty good though. He does get out of there. All right, Rupert's turn at the 4 1. He is gonna go for the I'm, a, I'm an equal to MFP strategy. Nails it. Oh, and the waterfall jukes him with the- Oh, gets his P-Speed back, though. He's doing some flip-flappity turnbacks, and he makes it. Nice, dude. I love to see those backups. Nice. Haxer using his hammer. Gonna go for the... Boom. Yeah. The Chungus bro. You see how- See how with, without Fire Flower, you lose just a couple frames for the battles, but whatever. Not a big deal. Um, Haxer definitely doesn't want to take damage here. Both runners entering the level at the same time. Ooh, Rupert with the miss there. Nice, Rupert with the recovery though. That's good, that's good. All right, Haxer on his way. Making his way through. Gets the super swim. Where's the spinies though? He's good, he's in the clear. He is in the clear. So not taking damage there is really good for Haxer because now he doesn't have to double up on power-ups. However, flower there? Ooh, Rupert with the movement of what, six? He's going for the mushroom house though. If he gets the fire flower, this would be big. That would be really big for him. Ah, two leaves. And it looks like Haxer gets P-Wing after Cloud, bro. Very nice. And then he gets the star, bro. That's what he wants to see. All right, Rupert. No mistakes here. Oh, whoops. I gave it to Rupert. I don't know why I got my, my cards backwards, but I'm, I'm still... I got it. Haxer's gonna have to delay at the start here. Yeah! And Rupert makes it! 
Hax is gonna have to do fire flowerless strats to avoid those Kaizo blocks. Uh, I don't think he's going to get... Yeah, he's not, definitely not gonna get a flower there. You have to do a quick level... Even if you're guaranteed for your first card to be a flower, you still have to do a turn back. If Rupert gets a star here, he's gonna be guaranteed pretty- Yeah, that is great for Rupert. Hacks are gonna go for the early P-Speed. However, he wants to get Fire Flower first. I don't know if that was the right decision, but I think he might have time to do this. You think he's in the clear here? He let his P-Meter run, run dry so he can do his normal strat. And just like that, he gets it. Just like that, he gets it. The early P-Speed. Early P-Speed for Hacks are right there. He's gonna make his way through. Oh, and Rupert takes the damage. That's exactly what Haxer didn't want to have happen to him. But he does make a recovery just like that with the super swim. Wow, very nice recovery on Rupert's side. That was good. That was very good. All right, as long as Rupert can make sure that he fights the cloud here. As long as he makes sure he can fight the cloud here. Then he's good. That has got to be the cloud. That has to be the cloud, right? They didn't switch. That is the cloud. Very nice. Rupert, I I have to give him the point now. There's no way he's not going to fight that, that P-Wing, right? Yeah, see? And then Rupert's got to do the Mushroom House again. So unfortunately, while Rupert's trying to catch up a little bit, he doesn't have a choice here. He has to... Um, he's got to do the, the Mushroom House because he got P-Wing last in this world. So if he, if he beats this world, you get a P-Wing for beating this world. So regardless, he's going to have two P-Wings touching. Unless he's cosmic braining us so hard that it's the inventory, the pages, right? Right, if your last item on page one is a P-Wing and your first item on page two is a P-Wing, well, your items aren't touching because the pages aren't connected. So you have to use that P-Wing before. But he's going to do Mushroom House for sure. Yep, he's got to do Mushroom House. Ooh, should have done the Fortress first so he doesn't have to double screen scroll. It's going to be a little bit of a time loss for Rupert there. That double screen scroll, right? He ha he now has to scroll back and then scroll again. So two extra screen scrolls right here. Yeah, you see how that works? All right, let's see what he's gonna. Let's see what he decides to do here. Oh, and he gets it. He's going back for the fire flower though. Very very nice. You love to see it, dude. You love that is nice, nice. And just like that, he stays. He's getting the same points as Haxer. He just doesn't have those RNG points yet. And think, if he did get the RNG points and the duck on the airship in World 1 points, that would be incredible. And just like that, Rupert is done. Just like that. Just like that. Very nice. Very nice for both of our runners. Axe are going to go for the fire kill. Not going to get a chance for the off-screen wand grab. All right, just like that, Rupert's turn in the airship. All right. We're going to go ahead and give Haxer a listen to, make sure he's not getting those bumps. And we have um, other judges on the other side listening to Rupert's stream for bumps. So we're, we'll find out. We'll find out who's getting bumps and who's not getting bumps. Who bump? Who, bu who bump? Ba -ba -bump, bump, 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 bump. Sorry, guys. I was just spamming stuff. I was mouth spamming. Oh, Haxer with the amazing coin count. No bumps yet. Definitely gonna go for 5-1 P speed here. Wants to show off his skills. Ah, he's not gonna get it. Gotta run a little bit closer to that block. He knows this, um, but sometimes you get what you get. The, it, the, the P-Speed strategy in 5-1 is not difficult, but that jump is so tight that it's almost like it's RNG a little bit, right? You either get it or you don't. Alright, no bumps yet, and no music boxes, so... We'll see what he decides to do here. No more safety shaft for Haxer. He was, uh, season 1, he was safety shaft, uh... All, all tournament, he's, uh, definitely gone off the safety train now. He's stepped it up. Mr. Zaypress gonna lose that momentum swing. Alright, Rupert getting through the airship. Not a whole lot going on. Look at Rupert's coin count as well. Both memers here tonight. Double memers here tonight. No lifelines either, guys. Alright, Haxer. He's got pretty traditional uh, World 5 movements. Not a whole lot going on. Gonna use this music box here. Ooh, his music box. 
Um, if he goes for the spade card game, then that was a very bad music box usage. I'm pretty sure the spade card game constitutes as a usage. Is that a misplay, ladies and gentlemen? Maybe he's skipping. Maybe he's skipping the spade card. Maybe he feels like he has an advantage over Rupert. He doesn't. He does not. So let's see what happens. Yeah, I see he's not going to go for it. He's not going to bump. He's going to use the star. Maybe he's going to do the spade cards above. Maybe the Hammer Brothers have put him in a position where he, he doesn't have a choice. But uh, let's let's swing the cards over to the second half here. I'm talking a little too much right there. can't say that's a bad thing, but all right. Second half of the trackers. As you can see, Haxer already has Mushroom House. All right, it's Rupert's turn for 5-1. We got we to gotta make sure we watch Haxer here. Do what kind of time he gets. He used the star, so he should. He does actually have a couple seconds to make sure he nails the uh, the, the 280. So let's see what happens. Unless the Beanstalk memes him, which no, didn't meme him. He's good. 281, and just like that, 280. No bumps on the overworld map. Rupert's still looking good. Wings way through 5 1. Hammer Brother switch. That's pretty good for Rupert. You don't really want to do the Mushroom House in World 5. You don't want to. Human. We saw Human Must have yesterday. Oh, and Rupert! What the? Okay, he made it. All right, all right. That was scary. That was scary. Uh, well, as we were saying, Rupert, or sorry, Human Mustard was not getting any good luck from the Mushroom Houses. And it's one of those situations where, where it's like, well, I'm in too deep, so I can't quit now, right? Um, but the Mushroom Houses ended up costing him like three minutes in that one run. Maybe not three minutes, but a very long time. And there's uh, not much you can really do about it. So Rupert is in a position where he could get the star first. Um, so if he music boxes now, that'll be great. But he doesn't have the extra music box. Rupert making a nice jump over there. Hacks are doing great with P-Speed in 5-5. Does get it early. And now in 5-7, he also gets the early P-Speed and is able to keep it. Very nice. However, Rupert is not letting Haxer get too far ahead here. He is maintaining his Fire Flower and also doing P-Speed strategies. We need Rupert to get that 280, though, in the Pyramid. Oh, hacks are getting the Runaway Bro for World 5. And Rupert is in the clear. Very nice. Rupert, he's going to use a Music Box, which is nice. And he's going to Spade Card Game. So if Rupert gets this, uh, this would be big points for him. The add-ons. Here it is, Rupert. Last chance. And Rupert gets it. And that is a one-point advantage that Rupert is now also going to have on Haxer a little bit here. No bumps on the overall map from either runner. Rupert using a star. Oh, and that might cost it. Oh, the pipe missed too, and the, he's not going to be able to get peace speed back. Hey, man, tit for tat, right? One person gets the pyramid or the twisty castle. The other person gets the spade game. It's the way the cookie crumbles, right? All right, hacks are finishing the fortress. Oh, man, the vertical pipes, right? Vertical pipes. That's it. That's the way they roll. Nice. And there goes the 280 right there. Hacks are not bumping on the overworld map. Rupert with 82 coins, so he is in the clear. All right, 5-4. 5-4. are gets the no bumps on the overworld map. Very nice. Unless I missed a bump, but I don't think I did. All right, Rupert's arch nemesis, full big jump there. Nope, he's gonna go the other way, and he makes it. Wow, okay, very scary. <sighs> All right, there you see him. They're both doing pretty well here, man. All right, 5-5, five, five. Haxer did bust out all of the um, impressive P-Speed strategies in World 5, except for 5-1. Um, so his time in World 5 is very good. He did get bad RNG with that runaway, bro. That movement of four. Um, and then he's got to fight the music box. However, he did use a music box, but he got the extra music box in World 2. So he did definitely did not need that hammer, brother. And Rupert has already done spade card games, so he can get the heck out of there. He's gonna do the wall rub, make sure he gets the early P speed. And just like that, Rupert... Oh! Oh! Wow! All right! And Rupert is out of there. Not really losing any time with that strategy. Very nice. Let's see if Haxer knows his fire kills here. If he gets stunned trying to go for fire kill... 
He's not gonna go for it. He didn't know what pattern he got. That's fine. It's very hard. Rupert needed this music box, so that's actually pretty good. Very nice. Rupert, anti... Anti-coin ship strategies right there. Alright, Rupert's got two levels left, and then he's on the airship. Not too far behind at all. Rupert also hasn't bumped on the overworld map yet. And let's hope that he doesn't. A couple turnbacks there. Wow, those those backward shots are very cool. Um, interesting tech for Mario Brothers 3. If you gain P speed, jump in the air, turn around, and shoot fireballs, your fireballs will actually be shot at the same speed as your P speed. Whereas if you have P speed and you run forward and shoot your fireballs, your fireballs are slow as heck. It makes no sense. Naturally running forward, Mario is faster than his fireballs, but if you jump or turn around and shoot fireballs, the fireballs are as fast as P-Speed. Makes no sense whatsoever. Alright, hacks are getting the hammer and low pattern to start. And pretty decent hammer brother movements, and just like that, Rupert is out of world 5. Alright, hacks are not using a P-Wing here, so he's gonna have to go for the, the elevator strats. Ooh, just makes it. Rupert needs to use his cloud here. Items in his inventory, good. Rupert with the no bumps. And just like that, Haxer is... He should be able to get it here, right? He gets the 279, just like that. He's in there. As soon as Rupert gets a point, Haxer gets a point. Alright, Haxer's turn for 6-4. Doesn't get lagged out. Doesn't get P-Speed either. 99 coins. Don't get that coin ship. I think he's in the clear though. He does get coins here. Alright. Haxer keeping us entertained while Rupert is on an auto-scroller right now. Rupert is still in gear for sub-60, which is very, very important. Oh! Taking damage because he's doing blind jumps. Um, Haxer it has to do Mushroom House here. Because, that's right, he's got the hammer, and then he would've got the cloud, so if he used the hammer, his two clouds would've been touching. He has been practicing, ladies and gentlemen. That is the practice strike. Gonna use his star, and also get low pattern here. Don't know if he can afford that star, but he didn't have a choice. Alright, Rupert gonna go for the stomp kills. Alright, hacks are in an annoying situation. He might be forced to fight that hammer, brother, and if he is forced to fight that hammer, brother, and he gets a high pattern, you can kiss that point goodbye. Let's see what he does here. He gets the despawn strategy. Right on. He's out of there. Alright, Rupert returning the wand back to Gandalf. Or, uh... Saruman. Oh, and Haxer gets unlucky with the Hammer Brother. If this Hammer Brother gives him an up pattern, that would be so annoying. That, <laughs> that is so annoying. All right, let's see what he gets here. Oh, and he gets a low pattern. Three low patterns in a row. I mean, you cannot ask for better RNG than that. Wow, and right there. Stacking up the points. Rupert. Ah, oh, does not get a Fire Flower again. Very unfortunate. Alright, Rupert's gonna have to go do this hammer. Gets high pattern, so that's another point Rupert is not going to be able to get here. Alright, if Rupert uses Lifeline, I'd be telling him just get under 60 so you don't get that punishment, man. That punishment is way too big. Alright, he's gonna use a P-Wing here. Hopefully he uses it beside... He's gonna use a Leaf. Okay, okay. He's gonna use the leaf. Oh, hacks are not getting H2. And that's. Oh! <laughs> alright, alright. Enough of the dad jokes, guys. Alright, enough of the dad jokes. Rupert with the 277, not gonna secure that point either. Very rough. Very rough. Alright, Haxer not gonna go for wall jump. He's gonna use his P-Wing. Alright, Rupert here. Haxer's gonna get that extra one up. Missing those tail swipes. Gonna cost him. But not too much, hopefully. And he's in the clear. 
Very nice. Rupert making his way through level four. Nice big turn back jump over him so he doesn't get hurt. And he's in there. All right, dude. It's going to come down to sub 60 and inventory. Uh, Haxer. All right. Nobody in this tournament. Come on, Haxer. Be the first. Be the first, man. Do it. Do it. Oh! <laughs> Wrong clip. He clipped the wall. He clipped the wall. He needed to jump a little bit bigger there. A little bit bigger. Oh, nice tail swipe on Rupert's side. Hacks are going for the boom boom as small Mario, giving him the old bam bam. Nice. Memeing. Memeing up there. Memeing up there, Rupert. Did Rupert get special tile? I don't think he has yet. He has not got special tile yet. It's the hammer suit. That is the cloud. But unfortunately, he's not going to be able to special tile. Ooh, and that's low pattern. That's not what he needs. No. The special tile is above to the right of level f uh, level 6, I think. Right? Level 6. That's right. No special tile for him. Very unfortunate. So, again, special tile, fire flower from from the mushroom house right these are some of the points nice gonna use that hammer and he is out very nice rupert is definitely keeping up here dude a couple rng points went his way and he would actually be uh very close to haxer i mean it oh my god rupert with the old school strategies th that scares me way too much but he nailed it and haxer getting the fire clip and look at that almost full clearing world six almost full clearing world six moving on to world seven rupert needs to make sure that seven one doesn't doink him around you don't want to be getting doink dude it's in his best yeah definitely want to take damage there Ooh, short hop He's gonna be a oh he could have bounced actually up he's in the clear very nice goes to the sub pixel manipulation all right rupert gonna use the p-wing yeah use that p-wing that's right nice very very nice on rupert's side I think I, every time the run gets to like world six, world near the end of world six and seven, I, I turn I turn away from being a commentator into like a supporter of like like as if they could hear me, right? I'm like, yeah, do that, no, do that. And it's, never works. All right, five tries, Haxer. One wasted. Two. Three. Four. He does get it within five tries. Wow. Very. No oh. Rupert falls and almost takes the death, but doesn't. Wow. Falling in that hole is not the way to go. All right. Axel doesn't have a star, but he is going to be able to do um, traditional fire damage boost. All right. He's using the star. He's got enough stars. He's like, I'm using them, boys. Get them over with. All right. Falls into the devil's anus. It's all sandy down there. It's got turtle shells inside of it. Music notes. And Mario. Very bad place to be. You don't want to be down in this little pit here. Does fall in. Has a nasty boo-boo. Oh, it takes the damage there. Not, not a 7-2 that you want to see there. Yeah, you absolutely hate to see that, but it happens. No fanfares either from Runner, and no coin ships either, so we're still looking good. Rupert really needs to get 7-1 here. Haxer is starting to get the advantage of points here, with little points here and there, some RNG points. Ooh, that small hop. Rupert, first try, doesn't get it! Oh, Rupert almost got it. That would have been incredible, dude. He never did those in the tournament before, and he definitely was practicing. I, I love to see that he was trying that. I think he should have got it. I think the, the universe should have been like, you know what? He definitely deserved it. Oh, and he falls down. 
What happened there? That was... Dude, if you wall rub there, you might die. That Ah, oh, man, I've died there before. I always remember that part being super scary. Taking damage there is okay on Rupert's side, though. His hacks are gonna have to go for subpixel manipulation here. I think he still has an extra P wing. And is Rupert going to go any kind of subpixel manipulation? He's moving around a bit. Haxer, not. He does have his extra P wing. All right. These runners are in the clear. Come on, Rupert. Rupert is not set up to do stand clip. You have to be on subpixel 14 or 15, which means you have to physically move a pixel, not simply just move Mario's sprite left and right. Well, he has to move on the X axis. All right, Haxer out of item abuse island. Rupert making his way. Come on, Rupert. You got five tries, man. You got this. One. Two. Three. Four. Last try. Ah, oh, he almost makes it, dude. All right, he's gonna have to keep trying here. Haxer making great work of seven, eight. He's on his way. Oh, that was a perfect jump on Rupert's side. Bad RNG, though. There you go. He gets it. Very nice. He's in there. Actually, using a star. Just wants to get rid of it. For the somersaults. He's saying to himself, like, he's, he's in no rush right now, I think. He's rushing, but he's in no rush. All right, Rupert's gonna have to do... Nice, he does get it, all right. That's very scary. Is Rupert also gonna fall down in there? He is not going to. First try for Haxer, does not get it. Goes for second try. Does not get a second try either, and he is out of there. Not gonna go for the Fire Flower here, though. He's gonna go, does he? I wonder if he's got a plan for the airship. Right, maybe he know. Maybe he's got a better pattern for the boss if he music box clouds here. Let's see what he does. Music box cloud, and just like that, Haxer will get the two points going into World Eight for the item of his inventory. Looking clean. Uh, Rupert is just about there with those two points. Rupert is just about there with those two points. Rupert is on his way to item abuse island. It's very important what item Rupert uses here. His his inventory can be so clogged that he might accidentally mess something up here. All right, looking good. He doesn't need to use a P-Wing here as well, so he can save that. He's gonna use a, a, a P- Okay, he's good, he's good. Mm. Very nice. All right, working his way through Item Abuse Island. Very nice. He's got a Nether P-Wing, should be the last item in his inventory. So he should just press B, hold down, then press left. Let's see if he does it. B, down, he did. That's exactly what he did, B down left. Do, 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 do. Very nice, gets over. So he's only two levels behind Haxer right now. Uh, a couple pipe transitions, a couple inventory usages, and then he's on his way. Rupert has more than enough time to get sub 60 here. I don't want to see any more runners for the rest of the tournament get punished for the sub 60. I'm gonna go for 7-7 seven, seven for safety. I don't blame him. I don't blame him. That's technically, so let me just clear one thing up for people. 7-7 seven, seven clip, first try, is a 17 second time save. But it's a 17 second time save compared to doing 7-7, seven, seven, not compared to doing 7-8. And okay, let me just make that clear. In 100%, you do all the levels, where in Warpless, you only choose one of these. So, doing 7-7, seven, seven, you'll have to do the time advantage based on how long it takes you to do 7-8. And if you're not doing Hammer Suit, then 7-7 seven, seven is actually not that much slower than 7-8, so it's not a bad play here. He does have a leaf that he can use. Use that first one. 
It's gonna be a while before Rupert can prove to me that his inventory is clean. Now remember, the, the, the leaves from the hands do not count as anything. I'm gonna take the damage there, which is good. Probably grab the fire flower. Very nice. All right, Rupert. You got two tries to this clip. I've seen you not try them before. You got this. Ah, oh, first try missed. Jump a little earlier. Ah, oh, a little earlier. Very nice try. That gap, though, man. That gap. That's that's hard. All right, so he's gonna grab the fire flower here. No, he's not. Okay, he's just gonna grab it on the airship. And then now Haxer is in auto scroller land. All right. Here we go. Rupert is going to music box. He's gonna cloud. He's gotta use that star as well. Oh no, Rupert. Please tell me you've been practicing and watching. Please, man. It's so easy to have your mind run on that auto scroller. All right, I can open up chat now because we have all the auto scrollers. How much are you guys willing to bet that Rupert forgets to use that star? That he needs these two points, man. He cannot lose these two points. He cannot afford these two points. Come on, Rupert. He's got so many stars, he should have just used that star, right? He has two stars, so if he just if he just wasted that star. He has been pretty careful, but it's easy to let your mind run on auto scrollers. I've had it happen to me before. I mean, we saw Human Mustard die on this auto scroller yesterday. Total mistake. I hope he remembers. I want him to. I hope he remembers. He should. You give him hell. You give him hell, Penelope, if he doesn't, okay? You let him, you, may, you make sure when he's done the tournament races, you let him know. Never, never, never forget 2020, Rupert. All right, that's... Oh, Haxer gets the worst pattern possible. Very unfortunate. Doesn't, doesn't the map of World 8 right there look like the Holy Grenade from, like, the Worms game? Hey, man, Rupert can get Rangless. It's very... Rupert can get Rangless and all three hands. If anyone knows what the Holy Grenade looks like in uh, the Worms game... Take a look at the overworld for World 8. Holy hand No, that's from... Nice, Rupert. Very nice. Alright, here we go. is going to be the first one towards the hands. Rupert, use that star! Please! Oh, somebody's telling him in his chat. What are you doing, dude? Rupert would have remembered. He doesn't have chat open. Okay, good. Okay, good. Am I a mod? Can I time him out? Time that guy out, man. That's... Why would he do that? All right, Haxer. All right, Haxer. Ooh, hand two. You hate to see it. No hands, and he won't get the hand point. Very nice, Rupert, using that star. I love to see it. Yeah, don't, yeah, don't ban him. Don't ban him. I meant just like a timeout. He knows he shouldn't. All right, hand one and two for Haxer. I don't know. But I know... I know Rupert has his chat closed. Rupert is a very, very good sport. I, I really like Rupert. He's a good guy. Yeah. I don't know why chatters think that they can get away with it. I can, I'm, I'm watching both runners chat. <laughs> yeah, it's okay. Maybe they don't know. All right. Save the animals for Haxer. Not going to use the Myba strat. 
Not going to use the Maiba strat. Neither runner has taken damage yet. I want to see Rupert get through World 8 very cleanly. All right, second half of the Air Force. Doing pretty good. There's a weird wrench in the air. Thank God it's still not there. Ooh. Does Rupert get Rangless? Oh, Rupert gets Rangless! And just like that, he gets an extra point. Haxer gets Save the Animals as well. Right there. Rupert gets Rangless. Rupert, you are not far behind. Axe's got 18 lives. He's gonna get two more. He's in the clear. Rupert's got 19. We have to make sure, sure Rupert does not autopilot. All right, Hacks are making great work of 8-1. We finally get some levels here. Just like that, he's a... Uh... All right. He's gonna use the hammer suit now. Go for that sun kill. Doesn't use the sa the sands of Haxer. Gets the sun kill. Does the turn back. Gets the hill. Loses P speed, but that's okay. He did get the sun. He'd get the sun. All right. It wouldn't be the worst if Rupert got all three hands. He can afford it, and he needs the points. Axer taking the slow fortress. Doesn't have a choice, though. Using that extra star. Not gonna go for the P-Speed. He, he's in the clear. He's comfortable. He's feeling good. So he's safe. All right, Rupert. Rupert's going for it. How many hands does he get? It's hand number one. Not bad. Axer got two. As long as he doesn't take damage and he knows how to get through the hands cleanly. Alright, he's on his way out of there. Oh, Rupert only gets one hand! Not gonna be able to get that, but he does need to save the animals. Ooh, that was too close to him. Hopefully, hopefully Rupert has practiced this one. If you haven't practiced it, you're, you're definitely eligible to not only maybe make a mistake, but if you take damage... Guys <sighs> <sighs> are on the last auto-scroller here. He like slid on top of him. He's gonna despawn the last one. Rupert is safe. <laughs> wow. Oh my god. Rupert with the all Rocky kills. Wow. That was amazing, dude. Took my breath away. Ooh. Come on, Rupert. Both runners doing amazing. Got that extra star. I think he's in the clear with his items. I don't think he can get a Tanuki suit anywhere, guys. No! No! And that is it, dude. That is the worst thing that could have happened to him. But he does look like he's in the clear with items in his inventory, so we will give him that point. Haxer pulls a Karua there. That's okay. Rupert has enough lives, though. He will not get the no damage point. He's gonna take damage here. Ooh, man. Haxer had the little slowdown there, but he's good. And just like that, Haxer with the 20 lives, no damage, and first place. No sub-54. Rupert gonna use the hammer suit now. Right. 
Rupert got the sun? Very nice. Very, very nice. Uh, we can't switch over to Rupert's audio because he's got some weird waving. Yeah, you can eat. It's okay. It's okay. It's, uh, it's, it's definitely okay. So, uh, that sucks. Remember, the, 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 the leaves from the hands don't count. But that's okay. He's got more than enough time to get through this. He is gonna get the second place, though. Very nice, but he can, he can get the 20 lives. That's the last... Ooh, that was close. Would he still, yeah, he'd still get the sun kill point, of course. Yeah, yeah, Trash Panda. No, I, I understand. It's one of those, it's hard to, it's hard to get your head in that situation. Damn, dude, that death cost him. One, two, two more points. That, that death was hard, man. Dying in 8-1 when he hadn't taken any damage yet. Like, yeah. Oh man. He 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 lucked he lucked out on a good chunk of points there. Yeah, we've had we've had multiple runs under 54, yep. Rule one, don't die, rule two gets sub 60. Yeah, those are your big punishments. Those are the biggest punishments. Fanfares, point chips as well. Okay, you got time, right? At this point, at this point, you have enough time. There's no point in kind of rushing anything, right? Rupert's getting his dot done ready. Very nice. Yeah, the, the, going for the meme clip. Yeah, the, uh, the leaves from the hand stage, they don't count as anything. They're, they're not even... We don't even recognize them as items in this tournament. They don't they don't matter. They don't mean anything. You pretend like they're not there. Nice, gets the one up, got 20 lives. Gotta make it work here though. Yeah, so a lot of people have have suggested that if you die, does that count as taking damage? And yes, it does. It's a combo wombo. That's what makes World 8 very difficult. Not an easy world to get through. Go the Haxer. Haxer's already finished. And we got Rupert going on. We got the Roops. He's got the 20 lives. Man, oh man, that death. Man. All right. And they are off. And just like that, both runners are back in action exactly the way that they started before both runners very close uh before we got into this race we did talk about how close rupert actually was to a 20 point game it turns out that if he would have done the ducking on the airship if he would have not died and maybe just got a little bit more lucky he would have got a 20 point game that's right you would have got a 20 point game right there. That would have been incredible. And Rupert is already playing better than the first race. And this is just awesome. You love, you love seeing two races, man. You love seeing these two things go down. Both these runners are trying really hard. Both these runners definitely want the gold. No lifelines used from them yet though. Maybe Rupert has used his lifeline, but I don't think so. I don't remember uh, giving Rupert the old lifeline treatment. Ooh, getting the clip there, gonna slow him down. 
Gonna give Hacks their chance to catch up, but both runners avoid the orb. And look at them, man. The sinkage. Wow, you love to see it. Alright, neither runner gets the random bye-bye P-speed. That's good. Alright, we're looking for P-speed keep. And we don't want heads stuck in ceilings. Wow, Rupert keeping his P-speed. Gonna get the bounce. Double jump. Hacks is gonna flub it up! Rupert's gonna take the lead! Haxer is going to take the damage! These are the kind of things that Rupert needs, man! These are the kind of things that Rupert needs to, to keep this... Oh, man! First place would be big for him in the race in time, right? So this is, uh... See how this race goes. Hacks is gonna have to get that extra power up there. Ooh, Rupert! Wow! Rupert gets... <gasps> oh my god, he's running too close to the edges. It's scaring me. He got it though. He got it though. Haxer right behind him. All right, first frame jump from both these runners. Come on, guys. Oh yeah, Rupert's gonna go to the mushroom house first. Does he get the fire flower though? Oh, those mushroom houses don't like him right now. They're just against him. Does he get the frame perfect jump though? He does not. And I don't think, I don't think Haxer got Frame Perfect Jump either. I don't think either of them got it. No. All right. All right, here we go. The Duck Bros. The Duck Boys. This is one of those points that Rupert desperately needed last race. And they're off. I always picture them as, like, horses, and here they go. Oh, and Haxer stood up again! So if Rupert gets this and got the last one, that would have been a four-point difference. That is not- Oh, and no! Both runners having a naked world one again. Man, oh, man. Rupert had the opportunity to have an additional four points. That's a lot of points. He's not gonna nail it though. It happens, man. It's not his fault. I mean, not getting the fire flower from the, the Hammer Brother makes it even harder to do the airship, right? You gotta get the fire flowers to get the fire kills. You got fire kills for Boom Booms in World 2. Fire, fire, fire. And that's what happens. Alright, here we go! World 2! Axer is going to take that lead there, being able to get that fire kill on the boss is going to allow him to get that advantage of time here. Rupert not far behind though. And like I said before, after 2-1 you always get a movement of 2. You don't want it to be a left, and of course it is of left. Whoa! Oh, Rupert clipped into the wall there. That's cool. All right. All right, Haxer in 2-2. Not gonna fall into the moat of tears, I hope. And not falling in the moat of tears. Definitely does not want a fanfare of stars. That would be a nightmare. Oh, and Rupert falls into the pit! Going to have to take that death. Luckily, in that situation, it's just one point, you know, whereas in World 8, it, that's kind of a, a two-pointer, right? That's kind of a two-pointer right there if you died in World 8. Kind of the best place to die, in my opinion. An RNG point can fix that baby right up, and it was a quick death, so actually not as bad as you would think. World 3, if you die, the bridges are all out of sync too, right? So that's kind of one of the better places to die. All right, both runners, I think, are getting movements of one. Nice. We're gonna go for a stomp. However, what that death does do to Rupert, though, is that it lowers the morale, right? The death is like, well, there goes race two, but it's not always like that. I mean, it is like that. I mean, that's why most runners feel that way when it happens, but, you know, it's not always like that. 
Right? We, Haxer could could pull a Mars and use a warp whistle. Oh no, Rupert got stuck. Now I'm wondering. Now I'm wondering what this means. He's gonna pull through though. Little bit of a slip up here. However, it's kind of funny if he would have got the oh my gosh, the stupid pipe. If he did get the duck, the ducking on the World 4 airship, he would be still be tied in points. It's that's interesting to think about, right? Come on, Rupert. Pull it back, man. Gotta pull it back. You know, I also find it very strange that we're getting the opposite effect right now. Uh, most runs most runs that we've watched, or races that we've watched to this tournament, have resulted in uh, game one kind of be a, a little flimsy, and then game two, boom, super tight. Seems to be backwards here. That is a hate, you hate to see a moment, but Rupert's gonna try and do everything he can. He knows right now that time is not gonna be his friend, so he's gotta go for as many RNG points. He's gotta take as many risks of RNG as he possibly can, right? That's how it's gonna be. That's how it's gonna go. Alright, Hacks just gotta go to the mushroom house now. Let's see what he gets. Ooh, not getting the fire flower, but he does wean it down. He does wean it down. Alright. Neither runner got the first one. We'll see if Rupert gets the sun. Alright, Rupert's right in. Oh, and the shell goes right through the sun, man. That is. That's kind of why there's a disadvantage. He does he does know how spotting works though, so that's good. Nice, and he gets the clip. Both runners got the sun, right on. I don't think Haxer has. Did Haxer get the flower sun, the flower star mushroom? I feel like he did. He didn't go for the flower there. Just like that, Haxer's gonna be out of world two. The sun has very, very jank hitboxes. Yeah, yeah, that's what I thought. Mitch keeping score, question mark, question mark. What's the problem? One for the money. I didn't instantly activate the points right away. Let me get it for you. <laughs> All right, both runners did get movements of one in world two. So they are not going to be able to get rewarded with the movements of two. All right, come on, Rupert. You just need to go to, yes, the Mushroom House. Come on, get that Fire Flower. I want to see some points, man. I want to, get some, I want to see some points. No! Enough of the Leafs Mushroom Houses. How? Rupert has done like 20 Mushroom Houses and he can just not get, ooh, how come he didn't use the Leaf there? Well, the first Leaf. The first Leaf would have been pretty good. These are scary points to get. Nice, going through. Yeah, get the run right through. I love that strat. Very nice, very nice. Boom. Activates that. Don't get stuck in the hill. Nice, okay, we're good. All right, Hacks are gonna go for fire kill. Another oh, doesn't get, man, get those frame jumps. Could have had a nice chance at off screen one grab. Bada boom. Both players got the sun. Rupert is still only behind by two points. I mean, not, not that bad, man. Those deaths were not as long as you think. All right, hacks are going into three one. Bacon, my make mo, my bacon bucket. Sea creatures come from the sea. Right on, right on, guys. It's looking good. Looking good. Hax is going to be the first one to finish the old 3-1. Not a lot really goes on in 3-1. It's kind of a... It's kind of a boring level. It's like a free speedrun level as well. 
All right, here we go. Whoa, Axer with the scary movement again. I don't think it's gonna mess up his... No, nope, he's definitely gonna get the early P-Speed. Very nice. Rupert getting pixel. Oh, oh, the jump. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, that was so close. He was so close to it. All right, we in there. Very nice, Rupert. Very nice. Axer gets runaway, bro, just like that. Axer gets runaway, bro, just like that. Almost missed the jump there, but he's looking good. He's looking good. No coin ship. That's also good. Um, the beast speed. So how's Haxer gonna deal with coin ship here? How is he going to deal with coin? Or sorry, not coin ship. Runaway, bro. Is he gonna come back? Oh, that's wow. Okay. All right. All right. Door three. Let's see if he gets it. He's not going for door three. Already feels like he's behind enough. He's got no points to his name in this world, though, or in this run yet. Rupert not equipping the, um, ooh, wall clip, too. He's going to lose his piece speed. I, he sh definitely should have clipped the, the leaf there. Oh, and the runaway bro runs back. Axer can still get special tile, though. However, if he goes for that hammer brother with the hammer, um, he has to, uh... This is rough. This is rough. What is he going to do? What's he going to do? What's he going to do here? Gotta skip it. No special tiles. He's not going to go for the star, though. Nice. Rupert staying out of the water, though. That's actually pretty good. That's not bad. He was definitely inside that fish right there. That's pretty scary. You don't want to take it. We've seen in the tournament runners take some deaths. Ooh, flower star flower. It's like every time Rupert has a flower and star, he forgets how to do the mushroom. But when he doesn't need to worry about it, he gets a mushroom every time. All right, Rupert looking good though. Rupert looking good. That's right. He's catching up, man. No dicking around. Haxer's not gonna go for that star, so Haxer is in the clear for no H2O battles. Very nice. Rupert out of the way of coin ship, which is really good. Haxer almost messes up H jump, saves it though. And Rupert gets the flower again. He is on his way. I don't have a choice, Rupert. You gotta go. What's what's he doing, Rupert? Oh, he's just thinking. He's just thinking. It's okay. All right, come on, door three, Rupe. Oh! Every time someone goes through that door, I think they get it. I always think someone gets door three. Such scary points. All right, I just gotta make his way to the fortress. See what he does. All right, that's good. Yep. Hopefully, if that hammer brother mo moves over the mushroom house and back, then then Rupert can definitely get a point back here. Rupert could be ahead of Haxer right now by like I don't know two points. I think possible. All right, flower star. Oh, no. Go. Ah, oh, so he's not going to get special tile, but he is it. That's fine, though, because he is going to get no water tile, right? He's, he's trying to collect the points that he can, which I think is the right play. However, from those deaths, right, we, we did talk about how it's more risky. Ooh, he's going to go for the fire flower. Yeah, so he's taking the RNG risks. Does he get fire flower here, though? And he does get it! Finally, the mushroom house does something. I don't think I've ever been so excited for a freaking point in my life. I don't think I've ever been so excited. I mean, Rupert's done like 90 mushroom houses, man. Sometimes the mush houses, they just don't want to work, right? All right, Rupert, you can tie it up in points right here, okay? You can tie it up in points if you can secure this mushroom. Just run straight for the card and do like a mild turn back and you're good.
All right. <laughs> All right, Haxor is now entered. World four. Rupert is behind by two lives though, so he must know. <laughs> All right, Rupert. He does get it though, and just like, whoa, what? I gave him the 20 lives? Oh no, he's not getting, what's going on here, points? All right, Haxor does nail it very nice. He gets through that 4-1 very clean, exactly how he wanted to before. Rupert is, unfortunately, a very large margin behind. <sighs> Taking damage there, that's not gonna help him keep up. Axer did have a little bit of a mess up as well, though. All right, he's out of there. Oh my god, the turtles are despawning. Nothing's going his way, but he does make it. He's good. Meanwhile, Haxer does a better 4-2 than last time. He does have Firefly this time, where last time he did lose it, so... He should be okay. Does he get the mushroom? He does get the mushroom, and just like that, Haxer is going to take the lead back with that mushroom. Just like that. First world where a runner can get punished. First world, the Haxer is already getting punished enough with movements of four right there. Haxer does not have a hammer, so he has to do the fortress. Ooh, he was like inside that shell. And just like that, no punishment for him, man. He's in the clear. He is in the clear. Gets another flower, although he doesn't need it, so he's definitely memeing. And the Hammer Brothers, just all movements of four men. They are all over the place. Axel does have to do the fortress, though. This is a very scary fortress. Let's see how he does. Just fine. No worries right there. Nails the fortress. And just like that, he's out of there. He is down a star, which is probably why he didn't use the star for this level. He is down a star. All right, there you go. That's good. That should be the, the cloud, right? Yep. And he knows the star is right there, so he's, uh... Oh, the bad RNG! So Haxer cannot get that point, and Haxer is forced to do a mushroom house as well after he gets the P-Wing. All right. Rupert making dirty work of Wendy. Getting dirty with Wendy. Hacks are missing the Lakitu jump. Where does that come from? <laughs> Look out! Look out! Alright, you should be in the clear. Alright, in the clear. Very nice. Very nice. Gets through. Hey man, you gotta make do with what you got, right? He's just, he's, hmm, okay, okay. So he's gonna P-Wing him, or music box, so he doesn't have to do the Mushroom House, I think. All right, and then he doesn't have to do all that cluster. Oh, Rupert! Yeah! Getting out of there. Very nice on Rupert's side, making do with what he had. We've talked about this before, like two seconds ago. Go for the Mushroom House. I don't think the last item he has is a P-Wing. But maybe he gets a fire flower here. That uh, would have been pretty clutch, but he does not get it. It's an opportunity for Rupert to really, uh, really nail some points here. <laughs> Axer does get early P-Speed though, so he's gonna take that point home with him. I know guys, I'm, I'm doing commentary the best I can, but I'm very on edge with this race. Because it's like, Rupert is still so close, so I'm just like hyper-focused on everything that's going on. Alright, Rupert gets the cloud first. Definitely needs to nail that P-Wing, though. Couple levels behind here. Don't get punished in this level, Rupert. You did it last time. You can do it this time. I know you can. Axer is on the airship now. He's got a whole lot of nothing for two minutes. Ah, oh, that jump into the hill always scares me. Ah, oh, we've that is the most oh You can't avoid that one. He does have a chance though He 
does have a chance, though. He, he, he didn't finish the level, right? He could use that first leaf. He could, yeah, he could use that. There you go. Nice, nice, nice. Trying to take damage here. Yeah, right through. Okay, here he goes. He still, he doesn't, he didn't finish the level. Ooh. I don't know if he wanted to take that damage. <laughs> Him. Whenever you do the level perfectly, you're like, why the heck couldn't I do that before? And just like that. So he won't get punished, but he did die. He did die. Dang it, dude. All right. Now he's got to be swimming blind here with the Lakitu. He's swimming blind. But he doesn't have much. Oh, he's going to go for it. Okay, he's not going to go for the mushroom. That's terrifying. He's risking it now. Nice, dude. He doesn't care. He's saying, you know what? I've died three times. I'm going for it. This is going to be frightening, though. Drop. Wow, okay. Oh, my gosh. Dude, the Lakitu's are never ending in this. All right. Hacks are doing mega pog jump. Does he know which Hammer Brothers which? And he gets the P-Wing and just like that, he gets his point back. Hacks are gonna go for the off-screen wall grab. Doesn't get it, doesn't get it. Now Rupert gets the star. Now Rupert doesn't really have to go for the mushroom house. House. I hope he knows that. Hope he knows that. He's gonna have to stand at the beginning. Go for the big pog jumps. He's in the clear. Get the mushroom. Yep. Then get the star. Boingy. Bounce off the block. Grab the star and he's good, man. He should be able to just jump, jump, jump. Nice. Nice. He's out of there. Boingy. Right on. All right. Early P speed for Roop. He got it last time. Axer is now in world five. All right, early piece speed for Rupert. Oh, he doesn't get it. Is he going to go back for it, though? He is going to go back for it. We saw Human Muster do the same thing, which is the right play. However, Human, Human Muster accidentally died when he tried to do a very small jump, which is crucial to this. Rupert's got to get all the points he can get. Don't blame him. There it is. He does get the early P speed. Just like that. Rupert. Punch it in some points when he can. Almost takes damage. Doesn't get P speed back. Nice. He's good. Alright. Sub 60 though for Rupert. I don't know, man. That's gonna be tough. It's gonna be tough. It's gonna be very tough, but we'll see how this goes. All right, Haxer gets the movement of four. Haxer has still not done any bumps in World 5. Not that I've heard. You guys can... can use this music box. All right, making good work of that. Everything's fine. The problem with facing up against some of the top tier runners is that they can make mistakes, but they most likely never... Uh, die as well and that's one of the advantage that some of the the big uh, the more top runners have No bump on the overall map. He was definitely taking it carefully Haxer using a star in the twisty castle Could be interesting considering he is down a star. He did not have a star um, From world three. However, he did get the star in world four So I think that kind of like makes up for for the stars and Rupert does have 69 coins You love to see it. Haxer loses P speed this could affect his ability. He's not going to be able to get it back. Oh, Rupert, what? I've never seen that before. I didn't know you could take damage if you run up against like that. I've never seen that. Haxer just gets the 280, so he is going to be able to get it. Let me go back to the second half of these trackers here. Haxer does nail the 280. Just like that. A little bit of flip flap in here, but he does make it, man. He does make it. The little flip flaps for safety. Uh, 
Let's do the flip flap for safety. Early P speed 5-5, five five, very clutch, very nice. All right, Rupert, just don't go through him. That's the worst thing that can happen. All right, he's in safe. Hacks are avoiding coin shift right there. Wow, this is so close. So close. Don't worry, I've been good with the commentator's curse today. Hacks are losing an early P speed there. Was by accident here. Slipping up a little bit here. Haxler's definitely not playing as well as he played in the first race. Slipping up a bit here, but I mean, uh, every runner's got steam, right? When does the steam start to run out? We don't know. Haxler has not bumped on the overworld map yet. Rupert has now entered world five. Haxler getting a bunch of movements of four. No bumps on the overworld map. Rupert's making his way through. Looking good. Gonna have to do the big jump. He knows it. Rupert knows the strats, man. Boom. Just like that. Get another flower. Alright. Hacks should be in the clear here for overworld bumps. <laughs> oh my goodness. Rupert and the, the Shaft of Shame are like mortal enemies here. Oh my god, scared me like that. Two times, Rupert. My heart can't handle it. Two times in a row. Nice, getting the jump, keeping the P speed. You're keeping the butt sliding speed. And he is out of there. Almost falling down the shaft of shame. Not quite. Looking pretty good, though. Alright, just like that, Haxer made his way out of there. He's... Out of the way of coin shifts and whatnot, so he's in the clear. Don't want a music box. Ooh, he just lost this spade card game, and Haxer is going to get the no bumps there. Just like that. Just like that. No bumps for Haxer. He has that nine points. Rupert at six. Conven convenient. Mm, six to nine. These runners are going full meme tilt here. Alright, so Rupert is gonna find out that that music box is going to be not his friend. Ooh, Fang Beard. And the Hammer Brothers are awake. No, don't be the P Wing! If it is. Oh, no. Just like that. Yeah, just like that. It, it, that wasn't my... I didn't jinx anything. The mushroom... He he used the music box. Did he... He got the special tile, though, right? Did he activate the tile? Nice, okay, he did get it. I didn't jinx anything. He used the music box before the fortress. He was supposed to use it after the fortress. That wasn't my fault. That's just game tech. I didn't, hey, I didn't make it a P-Wing, okay? All right? That's just the way the cookie crumbles. And that's the way the cookie crumbles, guys. All right, Haxer made his way through the airship, Rupert. Slip, slip slump in, in world five, but that's okay. Nice, go for that kill. 279 for Rupert. He's clutching in the points now, guys. Rupert is clutching in the points. Wait, did Rupert get 279 or 280? Oh, never mind. I take it back. Sorry, Rupert. I was getting too excited, man. That was so close. Axer with the low pattern as well. I'm getting too excited. I told you guys this race is too good. Okay, this race is too good. There's so much going on and I love it. All right, here we go, Haxer. Haxer needs to go for the 279. Rupert's still not bumping on the overworld map. Looking good. Right, it was a 279.9. Haxer gets the full jump over 
the concrete blocks, which is exactly what he needs to get the, the, the point here. Seventy nine for Haxer right there. Ten points. All right. Come on, Rupert. Spade game for me. Spade game for you. Oh, yo, he's got this. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Yeah, nice, Rupert. Very nice. He's keeping up in points, dude. If Rupert didn't die three times, he would have more points than Haxer. If Rupert got the duck on the airship, he would have four more points than Haxer right now. Four more points than Haxer right now. Insane, dude. Hey, that's special tile, Haxer! Is he gonna activate it, though? Does Haxer remember? He does remember. Gets the special tile. Rupert's still not bumping on the overworld map. Haxer using a P-Wing. Was that low pattern, though, with the Hammer Brother that Haxer did? I don't think that that was low pattern, was it? I think it was high pattern. All right, Rupert's on his way to the fortress now. No, it was high pattern, right? Nice hacks to get to despawn. Rupert making his way through the fortress, looking looking hot, looking hot and heavy. He's fire flower suit and in the lava fortress. Axel's not gonna be able to get the high patterns. I just gotta fight this hammer, brother. Nice, get the P wing. Or sorry, the cloud. Get the cloud, looking good. Damn, dude, Rupert. He's done so well in this tournament, man. I'm so proud of Rupert. He, he signed up for the heck of it. That's that was his words exactly. Eh, that looks fun. So I hope he had fun. Hope he's had fun, because, I mean, I don't want to count him out just yet, but, I mean, we need Haxer to use, like, a warp whistle or something. That's what, that, that's what we're looking at here. Right? I don't know. I don't know if he's going to use it. He, Haxer's almost the whole world ahead, and Rupert, I don't even, I'm not sure if he can get some. Well, let's keep it up, though. Let's keep, let's, I'm staying positive, man. No bumps for Mr. Roop, that's right. Yeah, Haxer needs to like have a seizure or something in his chair and just die a billion times. That sounds uh, like awful, but I'm talking from a video game standpoint, not a real life standpoint, all right? So just, I mean, just, just keep that context there. All right. Using a star. I think he wants to get the one up. Yes, he does. Very nice. No, if Haxer's console, if a console crashes during the tournament, you're allowed to pause your timer, get back to where you were, then start your timer back up. So your console crashing wouldn't be bad. It would only be warp whistle or something. All right, Haxer, you have to do this. Someone has to do this. Oh, and he did the exact same thing, man. The exact same thing. And Rupert made his way through the airship. Now he is now entering world six. Let's go, Rupert. Get some of those RNG points in world six. Get the floor clip, my dude. He got the exact same thing both times for that clip. That's funny. All right, Haxer is now on the airship for World 6. Rupert is following closely. Mm -mm -mm, right in there. Beep, 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 beep. All right, Rupert. You got the extra P-Wings, I think. Doesn't have to worry about his items anymore at all. I wonder what, I wonder what Rupert's looking for here. Because he knows his items are touching, but that's okay. Very nice. He gets a low pattern. That's what we want to see. Nice. Using the P-Wing. Try and get some points. Oh, no. The wall rub. It's okay. He's still in the clear. 
Oh, the door missed. That's going to cost them. It's so insane what kind of mistakes people make in certain situations. Like, I don't think I've ever seen Rupert miss that door. But that, that missing that door was the only thing stopping him from getting the point. That was it. Right? What, what are the odds, man? Wait, Haxer got the clip there. Haxer did get the clip. Yeah, he got the fire clip. All right, Rupe. Here we go. Come on. Low patterns, man. No, low patterns and clips. Nice. Big juicy turn back. Haxer going to go for sub pixel manip. He got, the, he got the 15 right there. Hopefully he didn't click again. Find out. He should be able to get first try here. All right, Rupert. The Hammer Brother by the rock is the one you want to fight. No, um, uh, no lifelines, guys. I think Rupert might think he's too far behind that a lifeline would be a waste. Even though if he does get kicked out, of, well, not kicked out, but if he does get eliminated from the tournament, um, he didn't use his lifeline, which I think is fine. Imagine the lifeline carried over to the next season. Ah, something I didn't tell you guys. I'm just kidding, that won't happen. All right. Mm, he might have tapped again. All right, two. Three. Four. Last try. No, it does not get it. Rupert does get the hammer, and then Haxer gets his sixth try. What a meme. What a meme. All right, so Hammer Brother right there to your right. Mm, that's not the one, but he does get low pattern. Oh, never mind. I was wrong. I wasn't paying attention. I'm sorry. That's not my fault. Use the music box. Nice. He's in the clear. Rupert gets all low patterns. And just like that. Very nice. Rupert gets another point. Let's see it. Yeah, don't listen to me when it comes to Hammer Brothers. Rupert, please don't go for this strategy. Please. Ah, it's so scary. Nice. And Rupert get, or sorry, Haxer does get past Devil's Anus. Just like that. Nice, Rupert. Boom. And boom. Very nice. Rupert's strategies are too scary for me. The two they're what? Three scary five me? Too scary. Yes, both runners have already flowered star mushroom. Nice, gonna use cloud Haxer's inventory. That's where he's gonna. That's where Haxer's gonna get the boost in points on Rupert, which normally he shouldn't. Rupert just had a little, just a little accident, unfortunate. Nice, he wants to get that. No, it, unfortunately, it's not neck and neck, mainly because uh, the, the inventory points. Nice, he's gonna go for the other one up. That's good spot, man. You get your one ups where you can, right? Last time, Rupert fell in the little nook there. Hopefully, it doesn't happen again. Oh my god, I thought he had it, dude. Oh my goodness, dude. Alright, hacks are in 7-8. The hard level. This level's scary. Missed a jump here. Ah, uh, he's in the clear. That's, that's one of the scariest jumps in the game, I think. Alright, nice. Rupert's out of there. Let's go, Rupert. Equip that mushroom. Flower, anything. Take damage. Fire, flower, anything. Okay, okay. Alright, the clip is gonna be a little hard for Rupert with the tail here, so hopefully, hopefully something. All right, Haxer's next point that he can get is a mid clip in World 7. Let's uh, let's scroll the points down here, right there. Mid clip, Rupert. Rupert's still got fire clip here. Nice, Haxer gets meme clip. Ooh, gets, gets fake P-Speed. Let's 
Let's see if he gets it. First try and doesn't get it. Second try. Oh. All right, Rupert's gonna take damage here. Doesn't get a first try. Ah, oh, nice try, Rupert. Nice try. Hey, man, I hounded him to come back for these races and try for those clips, and he did, so... That's all that matters. All right. Don't fall back down, Rupert. I don't know what happened last race, but he fell back down. Nice, he did the little coin, coin wrap. I love it. Music box cloud, and he will get the same items touching point. And just like that, Haxer is out of World 7. Moving on to World 8 right now. Rupert making his way into World 7. And still get some points here. Dang. All right, Rupert, on to World 7. Don't take damage, okay. If you take damage, he would have to do, he'd have to either equip an item or, dude, I don't know. He'd have to enter 7-1, right? Unless he wanted to do small Mario clip, like how you clip in 7-7. Seven, seven. That's, that's the only way he'd be able to do it. Alright, Rupe, you got five tries, man. You got this, dude. You got this. Five tries. Seven one's gonna work this time. Oh, come on. One. Two. These are good jumps, too. Three. Oh, I jinxed it. Four. Come on, last try. Ah, oh, man. That was a good jump, too. That sixth one. Seventh try. Pretty good. Not five, though. All right, what else does it, what else? He's got mid clip in world seven and that's, that's about it. We got Haxer finishing up world seven. Haxer definitely not getting the same amount of points you'd expect to see. Um, kind of a, a low card here. I think he was just taking what he, what he had here. Um, he was getting, he's getting, he started rocky right off the, at the start. Not run away, bro. He got lucky with the bro item. So I think he was just going, ooh, Roop in a very scary situation here. Nice, he took it slow. That was a smart move. Very smart move on Rupert's side. Nice, he should be able to get the drop drop right from pipe to pipe. Very nice. Nice, Haxer getting the stomp kill. Go for Oscar Wall Grab. Doesn't get it. Rupert not getting a fanfare. That's good. We do not want him to get more points. Right? No more points. We don't want him. We don't want him to deal with the swiper no swiping, right? Nice, nice, nice. All right. Rupert off to 7-3. He's working his way to Item Abuse Island. Nice. Gets past the spines. Makes great work of 7-3. Love it. Haxer is in auto scroller land, so there's going to be nothing going on on his side for quite some time here. A couple minutes, actually. Look, it looks like a, a holy grenade. Uh, I don't know, a little bit. All right, 7-4. Gonna, Rupert's going to cloud it. Nice. Nice. All right, Rup Rupert essentially has two levels left, right? He just has the, the P-Wing here and another P-Wing. Nice. Use the P-Wing, gets out of there. Rupert has 15 minutes left. Maybe. Maybe he could. He only fell behind in the early game, and then he's been cleaning it up ever since. Got another P-Wing, yeah, right there. Three deaths and still sub-60 would be very nice. Oh, sorry, go back down on Haxers. haxer has got, got a lot of points he can still clean up. Same with Rupert. Mid clip, right? He's got to jump a little bit earlier for that mid clip if Rupert wants to get that. Nice, goes to the 7-7. Seven, seven. Yeah, World 8's not too long. So as long as Rupert, he's got two levels left here and then he's going to use Music Box and Cloud and then get the heck out of there. Yeah, depending if you get hands or not, World 8 is about 8, eight to 9, a little under 10 minutes there. 
Nice. Much better last time he made through 7 7. Acts are not getting rangless. Alright, here we go. Rupert is going to use a leaf. Ooh, he doesn't have a leaf here. Hey, could he use that fire flower though, right? Is he gonna go for the cliffs? Nope, he's gonna go back. Not a bad play, not a bad play. No lag here. Nice, gets the hit still. All right, Rube, come on, mid clip, buddy. Oh, so close. Second try, here we go. Oh, that gap, man. That's the hardest part about mid clip. That gap is right in the way of when you want to jump. All right, so does Haxer want... Does Haxer want all hands? I don't, I'm not sure how he, yeah, how he feels. I mean, regardless, all hands getting a point versus no hands or one or two hands, I don't think it matters at this point anyways. It really doesn't make a difference. Music box, Cloud, and Rupert is on his way. Easy peasy, just like that. So, by the time he lands on the airship, it's about two minutes. Wow, so, Hack, so Rupert has almost exactly ten minutes to get through World 8. So, he definitely needs no hands, I can tell you that. He definitely needs no hands. No hands is big. No hands is a big thing right here. No, uh, no lifelines yet either. Alright, Haxer gets the first hand. As long as he doesn't take damage. Nice! We got Haxer doing stuff while Rupert's on the airship now. So this is actually pretty good, man. The, the back and forth here. He gets one hand and he's out of there. All right, save the animals. Good luck. Must be very quiet. Must pay attention. There's wrenches on both players' screen. All over the place. Hasn't killed any yet. He also hasn't taken any damage. Axer is missing a one-up, though. He is missing a one-up. He was caught. He was caught in a rocky place there. Get it? Alright, Axer didn't get Wrangless and all hands, but he does get the no rocky kills. Very nice. Alright. 8-1-8-2 for ya. And Rupert is just about to enter auto-scroller land, so we have to make sure, double-check, see if he gets Wrangless. Eight one for Haxer. Nice, Rupert does great work on the boss. Meanwhile, Haxer also does great work at the same time in 8-1. Not making any mistakes. He is down a 1-up, though. Yeah, Rupert is in a tough spot here. He's got, like, 9 minutes and 30 seconds. He's got- he ha- Rupert has to get no hands if he wants- Ooh, Haxer misses the sun! Not hitting the sun. I don't know if he's been in this situation before. Does he practice it? What does he do? Missed it. He's dancing with the sun. He can't, he can't get it. <laughs> he can't get it. The sun is just juking him out. And he just can't get the sun. Come here, you little... Oh, and he gets the sun. All right. Okay, he should be out of there. He does... <laughs> Absolutely amazing. You love that is what I love about this. That son was he was dodging, man. He was dodging all over the place. You love to see it. Let's get the sun point though. That runoff is always so scary. All 
All right, Rupert is again still on Auto Scroller Island. That was crazy what was happening to Hacks over there. Never seen that. I love Rupert's little kicks of the bombs. Those are awesome. Wait, where did Haxa get the extra life from? Where did he get it? I missed it. He had 17, then he got 18. Oh, the coins. The coins in World 8? Oh, yeah, I guess you get like 30 something coins. All right, we're good then. All right, did, did Rupert get Wrangless there? I was too focused on the coins. Mm. Yeah, I was like, ah, where did he get those? Nah, okay, I didn't think so. I figured chat would have popped off if we got the Wrangless. That's okay. All right, Rup you, dude, Rupert has to pull out the best World 8 he's ever done. That is the situation he's in right now. He might even have to go P-Speed 8-1 as well. Nice, Haxer gets the hammer kill, and he's on his way. That sun ruined his sub-54. That's hilarious. I mean, it's unfortunate, but I can't believe that, man. Sun cost him the sub-54, that's right. The sun, man, what a jerk. The sun, that, 8-2, there's always something with 8-2. 20 lives. 20 lives for Axer. Rupert's on his way for 20 lives as well. All right, Rupert, come on, man, no hands. Axer didn't take damage either. Come on, no hands, Rupert. Come on. Ah, hand one, I think that's gonna be it for Rupert. He's gonna get to take the second place, though. Uh, I don't think there's anything else left for Haxer right there. Yeah, I think 18 right there. That is not no hands. Ah, two hands. It's gonna make it even harder, dude. Rupert with the goofy audio. I don't know what is why his audio is doing that. No, Rupert doesn't have 40 seconds to spare. Alright, remember, seeding for future seasons can be based on your, your career total points. Um, so... Excuse me. Ah, 55 for Rupe here. Probably gonna be 56 when he finishes. And he still has like a minute and 20 seconds on the last auto scroller, so he's about a 57-20. Bowser's Castle takes a less than a minute with hammer suit. So 58-20. So he's gotta do 8-1, 8-2, and 8-4 in a minute and 40 seconds. But he can still collect points. He did get no Rocky kills. He did get no Rocky kills. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Get up there. He's good. Okay. Ah, oh, see? That's that stupid bullet bill launcher. That's the most famous part in A1 that messes with people. The same spot! The same that pipe.
pipe is slippery tonight. You have an extra hand fire flower. Yeah. Yeah, there we go. Try it again. Dude, what is with that pipe? Why is it so slippery? He's like, that's it. I got the piece speed. Every runner's got to finish their run, man. Good, good etiquette, right? Good whatever you want to call it. That's sun point. Surely he can do it better than Haxter. Come on, get it. The sun, man. I, what is... Why is the sun so hard? There we go. He gets it. Nice. Dude, F that sun right in the face, man. F that sun. Hey, man. If you come in second in the points tournament, at least you get one-on-one -on -one with me and my stream, right? Look at this. You get the one-on-one -on -one with me and the boys. And I think that's what matters most. One-on-one -on -one with me and the boys. No, he didn't get fanfare. He does have another star. Nice. Music box those skulls. Save some frames. Man, Rupert's getting hit with the little jumps. I think he did a great job. Um, he knows how well Haxer is at this game. He knows what he was up against. Um, I don't know Rupert on a personal level where if, I don't know if he gets really nervous for competitions, races, or, or tournaments or anything like that. Um, so I can't say if his nerves get to him. But with knowing that you're the underdog and knowing it's going to be very hard uh, for him to get the times points, he had very, very good chances here of actually kind of taking down hacks or especially i mean he could have had four points on him if he got the duck on the airship and then he could have had an additional five points as well if he not died he's died he's taken four he's, ta he's died six times i think Yeah, but even that, like, he was he was definitely not out, man. The duck on the airship, both races, he could have got four points there. He died six times, so that right there is ten points. Right? That right there is ten points. All right, unfortunately, however, he's got to take the cut, man. He's got to take the, the not sub-60. No, no, he can't sub 60. I gotta give him the cut now. He might be able to make it to the end of the auto scroller. And that should be just as far as he'll be able to take it. No lifelines used, which is Haxer, Zikubi, Ibuba, and Maiba all have their lifelines left. They all have their lifelines left. No, you have to finish the run to get the no damage. And you have to finish the run uh, to get the 20 lives. Unfortunately. Three, five, four, three, two, one, done. That's it. That is it. GG, guys. He is definitely going to finish, though. Might as well finish the run. He's right there. We love Rupert. Woo! No, man. I think everyone did great. In this tournament, every, every single person has done great. A fantastic job. Um... Good showmanship, right? No hard feelings between everyone. Um, people have been practicing. People have been scheduling as much as they can. Uh, people have been understanding. I, I just am so proud and, and happy with everyone who's been in this tournament. Oh. No. Not that way, Rupert. <laughs> nice, dude. That was sick. Taking the meme damage. Dude, you can run all the way back to the start of Bowser's Castle if he went up there. Yeah, that was sick. Right on, guys. Right on. Uh, so Rupert has a total of 22. And Haxer has 40. 